Oh, careful. Okay, so what we have going on today. Did you hurt yourself? Goodness. Okay, well what we got going on today, I know it's full spring and it's gonna get down to 20 this weekend, but we're expecting 76 today. And if I wanna go off what that little groundhog said, I don't know, I'm talking a bunch of BS. <laughs> Honestly, I have just a ton of seeds that I've been collecting for, oh, since I've been gardening, so probably about six years now. Um, and most of these, you know, they're only supposed to be good. I think they guarantee them like two or three years. I know seeds can somewhat be stored indefinitely, but um, I really just want to use a lot of these up. And a lot of these are ones that I've tried to grow, didn't have a lot of success. Back when I had a smaller garden space, I tried to pack in a bunch of varieties. So I just have all these packages open and some have a lot, some have very little. So screw it. I'm dumping them out. This is an area that the chickens can't get to. Um, so we'll see what happens. Over here, I put some Chinese chives out and this uh, Alexandria strawberry, which if my memory serves me, it's like a really old Alpine strawberry, or maybe not Alpine, but it's, I think it has like Viking history or something. And then over here is an area that grass tends to not grow. This will be really sheltered by lilac soon, but I figured what the hay, I'll give it a try. Um, it's an area where there's no grass, which is kind of a bad sign. But to be fair, when I moved out here, this whole front yard was dirt. We just got this grass going within the last uh, year or two. So, but I was, you know, it looks really rich to me and good. So over here I planted more chives. I did some radishes. I did um, a package of atomic red carrots, which was like a freebie pack. And I think I have several of those. So not a lot to lose there. Um, in the back, I think I did uh, some Florence onions, so if I get a little onion patch going there, that'd be cool. It might be a little too shady for onions. Um, you know, if we live somewhere with more rain, I know absolutely they'd get rotted, but we only get about 18 inches of rain a year. And one of my problems with gardening is everything really dries out. So I'm wondering maybe if that might work. Um, I planted some early purple sprouting broccoli some early purple cauliflower. And th these are seeds I've had for probably six years that I'm mentioning now. Um, so not a lot to lose there. And then also over here I put, what else? oh, I put some uh, ching chang bok choy. <laughs> That's actually what it's called. And uh, some Mizuna Benny, oh, I ripped the rest of that off. So, you know, nothing to lose, something to try. Feeling a little inspired make me a little nervous running around with that trowel baby girl. <laughs> 